Welcome to Odoo Essentials. Search engines are really interesting tools that can help you have a flourishing and prosperous business. It's not simple nor automatic, but you can use them as effective marketing tools. Thanks to SEO or search engine optimization, I'll now try to optimize my content for search engines. SEO is a good practice I'll use to try to have more visibility on the internet. With this, my products will have a better ranking in search engines such as Google or Egosia, and then I'll have more visitors. Properly using SEO will boost my website traffic and grant new visitors faster than if I ignore it. The problem is, I don't know all the SEO rules, so I'll want Odoo's assistance for this task. It has an SEO feature which will help me optimize everything more easily without all the technical complexities. So let's see how I can optimize my homepage and blog posts to get a better ranking. Okay, so here I am on the home page of my website. So I realized that my website traffic is too low, so I'm going to use SEO to increase the amount of visitors that I have on my pages. So first of all, um, note that the time required to load a page is an important criteria for Google. Okay, so of course, the faster your website will be, the better your ranking will be, and of course, it will also improve your visitors' experience as well. So to speed up your pages, Odoo compresses and catches your CSS files as well as your JavaScript resources. So your visitors only have to load the page one time. So of course, it allows you to um, gain some speed. And as you can see on my website, I can quickly go from page to page, okay? So it's no problem. So now we're gonna look into something a little bit more specific. So we're gonna look at our images. So of course, Odoo works the same way with the images. Um, Odoo automatically compresses them as soon as you upload them to your website. Okay, so we're gonna look at that right now. We'll go to edit. We'll scroll down, choose one of our pictures, and I'm gonna double click so I have this upload option. All right, so if I click on upload an image, when I upload the image, which I will do right now, it will um, automatically be compressed by Odoo. Okay, so of course this optimizes the performance, so I will open, it's compressed. However, I also have the option, if I don't want the image compressed, to click on this little arrow and upload without optimization. So if I choose this option, it does um, improve the quality of the image, but it does not improve the performance, which is what I'm looking for because I wanna maximize my SEO. All right, so I'm gonna save this, okay. Or I'm gonna close. And uh, the next thing we would like to add are some attributes for um, our photo, okay? So what we'll do is go to this description at the top right. Of course, we need to have the photo highlighted. Okay, and so we're gonna add two things. We're gonna add the description, the alt tag. Okay, so this will be a description of the photo. Um, and then we're also going to add a tooltip. Um, and the tooltip is also cool because it allows a small description when you hover over the photo. So I'm gonna add both of those and I'm gonna save and show you um, what this looks like, all right? So of course the description, is a dog sitting on chair. So if your uh, visitors are not able to load the image or for some reason it's not working, um, this uh, description will replace um, the image on the browser. All right. Um, and so for the next one, the tooltip, okay, we're going to say um, Joey is having a good day. Joey is the name of the dog here. So we'll go ahead and save. Then I'm going to hover over this. I have my description right there. And now I can see that Joey's is having a good day. So that's a pretty cool thing that we can do. All right. Um, the next thing that we need to keep in mind is the hierarchy of our titles, because, of course, the search engines use um, titles and descriptions. OK, um, so what we want to do is be sure that we do not have um, multiple titles that have the same priority. So. In this case, I have Stealthy Wood as my first header and my first title, okay? And I can see um, that by clicking on this little button right here at the top, and I see that's header one, okay? So of course, if I had two header ones, the search engine would not know which one to prioritize. So I need to respect the sequence of the titles um, and the headers, all right? So I have only one, header one, and if I scroll down, I have a header two, and then it goes down in that order. Okay, so now we're gonna save this and we're gonna talk about something else that also will maximize your SEO. And that is to have metadata for your pages. So what we're going to do is click on promote right here at the top of the page and go to optimize SEO. 
All right, so of course we have our title, description, and some keywords. On the right side, we can see um, a preview of what this will look like on the search engine, which is really a really great tool for you to be sure you have it exactly the way that you want to, the description that you would like to see. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna do is add some keywords. So the first one I will add will be handmade. And then I can choose my language. These languages will um, be based on the languages you have loaded on your database and for your website. Okay, I'm gonna select English and go ahead and add. Then on the right, we have some related keywords. So if we select one of these, it will automatically be added. Um, none of these are really related to my product, so I'm not gonna choose them. So I will go ahead and say custom, um, furniture, um, and unique. Okay, all of these keywords are um, good for my business. And I can go ahead and choose one of the related keywords that I have on the right. So in this case, I'll select customer service and it's automatically added. So that's just a little um, shortcut for you just to make your life a little bit easier. All right, and let's go ahead and add a description and see what this would look like on the search engine. Um, so I'm gonna use some of my keywords. So I'll say handmade custom furniture just for you. Okay, and we can see that preview, the description on the right. So it looks really good. So let's go ahead and save this. Now, of course, the best way to maximize your SEO is to have content on your website. Okay, so of course, to have pages and the images with the attributes that I've already showed you. And if you've been watching these videos, you know that Odoo offers a lot of modules and building blocks for you to easily add content to your website. So we're going to keep adding some content here. Um, and you'll see that in future videos. But for now, that's all for this video. And thank you for watching.